Hello, Larry. And how are you and Leopold getting along? Leopold? Oh, man, and I thought I masturbated a lot. That's great. Just great. Oh, if you'll excuse me, Larry, I've got a phone call from my husband. <laughs> Hello, honey. What? Her? No! You can't do this to me! I hope you get anally fisted by a gorilla, you bastard! Well, sounds like you're on the market again. What's with you men? What do we have to do to please you? Well, when the romance heads south, there's no problem a little role-playing in a 12-inch dildo can't solve. Larry, listen to me. I've put nine long years of my life into this relationship, and the son of a bitch up and leaves for that fat whore who works at Kenny's Shoes. I'm 36 years old. I want a child, Larry. A child. Well, okay. You want to do this right here? Oh, dear God. Ah, my time to strike has arrived. She is sensitive. She is vulnerable. Now the flowers and fruits of love shall ripen and bloom. She shall be my bride. So, are we uh, just gonna do this on the floor? Oh no, the boy understands. Tired you out already, did I? Turn around, you fool, face me. Okay, it's definitely time I stopped drinking paint. You will never have her. Five years I have waited patiently, rosebud lips and eyes like harebells bathed in dew. Cheek that with carnation vies, the music breathing from her face. Oh, how it makes my heart run wild. Sorry, man, I don't think she's into guys. I want to inspire lust and that beautiful complex woman exploring the sacred mysteries of her body. Oh, she will kneel on bended knee and behold the majesty of my stiff ramrod jutting from my overbounteous balls. And she will take it with firm hand and stroke and stroke until I unload a glut of hot spumy seed all over her. You, uh, paint quite the picture. There's a future for you in erotic literature. Oh, you young bucks are so full of beef, beer, and lust. What do you know of love? Well, I had a brief toward affair with a marsupial mole, so I know that you can get gonorrhea from just about anything, man or animal. You just end up with a Class D criminal felony on your record and a $5,000 fine. Ah, oh, heaven hears, but pities hapless men like me not.